Hey everybody, it's Moe of Houston. I know it's been some years since I've been on here, but um, just took a break for a while. Don't know why, just so much stuff been going on. Um, I know I had a few requests to talk about my lap band surgery, which I had it in 2010, but um. And I got hired in at Chrysler, and I could not keep my appointments because I wasn't getting home till 4 in the morning. My appointments were at 8. So, for a whole year, I did not go to my appointments, okay? Um, then, when I finally started going back, my port, he could get the fluid in. He could pull it out, but he couldn't get it in. So, I had to um, schedule... To have my port replaced. Um, and this was last, July of last year during our shutdown. But my doctor um, rescheduled it and I couldn't do it. Um, I could only do it within them two weeks and he couldn't do it. He could did it and I scheduled it for the beginning of the week from shutdown. And then they called me to make it the following week at the end of the week. Which I would have been back to work on that Monday. And I'm like a real crybaby don't like pain and I, he's like oh it's not going to be nothing but when you're cut, getting cut on it's it's going to be something to me so I couldn't do it so I finally went back um, almost a month ago for the first time since the surgery was supposed to and I held 38 pounds down he was like I'm so proud of you with you not being here you still lost the weight I lost 38 pounds um, and he, he was able to get the fluid in and out, but he said my port is tilted. That was the problem, but he knows how to do it now. But, um, he told me to come back next month and, um, they'll add more in. They go by CC, they add more and more and more and more on in. But, um, I was like at my fullest, I was at seven or eight CCs. And I couldn't hold water down, so I had to go to the emergency room and have them take some fluid out. So he knows that I can't go past those CCs. But um, like now, it's like me starting back from the from the bottom up. I'm on three CCs. So um, when I go back in on the 11th of April, he'll add another CC and go on and on and on. But if I um would have made my appointments like I was supposed to, I would be at my goal weight by now. Um, my aunt had hers a month before I did, and she's skinny. She's at her goal weight. But she can hold, I think she got nine cc's in her. There's no way I could hide, um, have nine cc's in me because I had a problem at seven cc's. Um, I remember New Year's last year at my brother's birthday party, I mean New Year's party, and um, I tried to lick the barbecue sauce off the chicken bone. I was hungry. So I licked it and I immediately went to the bathroom and threw the barbecue, that little bit of barbecue sauce up. So um, for those of you who were asking, I recommend a lap band to everybody. If you do right, like you're supposed to, it works. Um, now that I'm back on the right track and doing this, hopefully... I'll be at my goal weight by the end of the year. Um, but I do recommend it to anybody who wants to have it done. Get it done. Get it done. And it's not really no major cutting, no stapling, no nothing like that. They're just putting that little band around your stomach. And then as they every month fill it till you get to that sweet spot. And, um... It, the scars look like three little scratches. They go in three different ways. Um, maybe I'll show them to you, but right now I can't. I gotta put a brawl and stuff on, but I will probably do a video and show you the scars from it. But it, two of them look like scratches. The port where he goes in it every month is a little wider, but um, I, re I recommend it. And then if something goes wrong, they can take it out. If you get the gastro bypass surgery, you can't there's nothing they cut it out took out whatever they can't put it back but um this way they're not taking 
nothing out of me they're just at putting plastic piece around my stomach to make my stomach smaller and I do recommend it to everybody if that's you want to lose weight and it, it'll help you and do it do it and um that's it for the lap band i'm going to do another video right after this just talking about other things but if you have any questions about the lap band put them below and i'll try my best to answer it um, and if you're in the Metro Detroit area and you want to have a consultation, I will give you my doctor because I think he's, he's the best. He's in St. Clair Shores. But, um, I love you guys and thank you to everybody who asked for me to do this video and I'll be back.